are. Take it up. Oh. The one and only hip hop legend, the icon, my brother, <laughs> Buster Rhymes. <laughs> Oh, man. This was in the spirit of wanting to give people, from the second I stepped on the stage, a presence that spoke in volumes before they even heard my voice. And I felt like the dragon costume did it. I've been a costume-driven artist from the beginning because I was groomed and conditioned to be a showman. And showmanship is a, a very key ingredient and key component to what distinguishes the difference between artists that can create careers and legacies and the artists that don't. It's strange to just walk past people and not greet them, especially when they're helping you. That was weird. I guess it kind of like really falls in line with all of this COVID madness right now. You know what I'm saying? Masking up and gloving up and staying away from people and not talking that's something that I'll never really adjust to as long as you stand by me and darling darling stand me wait Griffin what are you doing no, I want to take this off right now it's not that part of the show yet <laughs> What would make you do the mass singer and come have fun with us? It was in the neighborhood. Get it stupid. Get it started. Get it started. Get it started. Let's 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 get it started. Being an eight-foot tall giraffe, sort of, uh, that's the topper. The giraffe was harder than I imagined because the costume was as intricate as it was. Okay, so here I am with the, with the mask. Looks cute, right? Um, it's not. I discovered that uh, dancing at 47 hurts. A lot of painkiller. When I first heard Megan, I thought, Oh man, she's on to me. I thought Robin would pick up on the Robin on my shoulder, and he did not. And then it just went completely off the rails in a complete different direction. It was nice being in a situation where nobody knew who I was. It's really been a two-week journey of learning how to mouth the puppet, calibrate a puppet, work the arms. The whole deal has been a crazy experience. It's been an absolute treat and a joy. Everybody's been wonderful to work with, so I'm very appreciative. I knew my son would totally dig it. DJ at home, I think him and I watching this, he's going to lose it because he has no idea. He's just been practicing these songs with me and playing with these silly puppets. I read to him before he goes to bed at night and I've been using this practice puppet. We've been doing that for weeks now. That's how I really got the practicing and all the puppetry down. I think once he sees me on TV, he's gonna like do a double take and have a lot of questions. the costume was not difficult for me at all. And they were kind enough to send choices to New York before I left to come out here. They had somebody go out and get me a cheap short wig just to get me through until the big reveal. I can't get me no satisfaction. No satisfaction. Ah! 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 Yes! Actor, entertainer, yes! comedian OG, Bob Saget. My relationship with the costume is I have been inside of it, so I am very bonded with it. He's, he's funny, he's lovable, he's like a big stuffed animal, and he's yet he's kind of, you know, he's kind of bad. I might take it home, I don't know if I'm allowed, but I've become very close with it. I couldn't see, you saw the best there was in me, lifted me up.
after we first saw a uh, basically a, a thumbnail sketch of the costumes and say no more we knew they were going to be fantastic we knew we were seeing kind of a mock-up and we loved it right off when i first saw the costumes i actually cried because, oh, wow. I, because they're so beautiful but they're so sweet once you're in it for five or ten minutes without a little fan in there to keep it cool. Then it's Bikram Yoga. Uh, it's a hot box. What makes the mask great is you can lose yourself in costume and be whoever you want. Weather now, see, haters get tight when you work some millions. That's why sport the chinchilla hurt they feelings. You can find see. I've been performing in front of people my whole life. This is an experience like I've never had before. Um, basketball, I have a whole team with me, and I have time you know, to study moves and stuff like that. My Matt Singer, I just came in here, had a whole new whole new look, whole new kind of character, and uh, just went after it. The only thing that was kind of kind of bad with the costume was the visibility. It was kind of hard to see. <laughs> You got me. She got it! It's just incredible and, and hard to hard to put into words what it feels like to be on that stage. As far as nerves, on a scale of one to ten, one being not nervous, ten being the most nervous you've ever been. I was about a 45. And what I learned the most about this entire experience is that life is too short to just do one thing. I'm outside of what I normally do on a day-to-day -day basis, and this is just a reminder that if you have a passion, if you have something that keeps you up at night, seek those things out, and uh, maybe one day you'll end up on the mass Singer too. So trying to describe what the costume feels like, um, imagine taking 100 pounds, putting it on your back, and then going into a 110 degree oven, and then trying to sing a song. Take me down and love me all night long. Hold me close and make me strong. Take me down. After doing this for 65 years, if you told me 30 years ago I'd have a broccoli on my head, I would have told you were crazy. Once you got used to the, uh, the in-ears and the mask and the whole experience of this, uh, then it came easy at some point to where you were able to function. How does this compare of everything I've done in my life being on here? Well, it certainly doesn't compare with being in a steam room with Frank Sinatra and Dean Martin and Sammy Davis nude. So we'll take that off the table. I like broccoli. I mean, I eat broccoli all the time. When I go on tour, I know there's going to be somebody out there yelling out, hey, broccoli, brock rock. Getting in that enclosed mask. Uh, the good part, lose weight. Make sure you're subscribed as we're covering the Masked Dancer starting the day before the premiere.